We first reported last night a longtime Metro officer arrested for allegedly driving under the influence after his apparent involvement in three crashes this past weekend. 13 Action News reporter Gina Lazara obtained the arrest report and has details on what it says. The arrest report for longtime Metro officer Antonio Munoz says when the trooper asked him to cooperate for a blood test, he made a sour face and shook his head no. The documents say an NHP trooper saw the 39-year-old driving poorly near the 15 in Charleston. The report says the trooper watched him cross over the white driving line and accelerate at a high rate of speed after stopping at a red light. That prompted the trooper to stop Munoz, and when the trooper asked if he had been drinking, Munoz reportedly denied having any alcohol and said he had cancer. Later in the traffic stop, according to that report, when the trooper noticed damage on Munoz's vehicle, the Metro officer admitted to being in an accident earlier in the evening. The trooper then indicated he discovered the Metro officer was involved in three hit and run accidents. The trooper cited him for 15 violations, including DUI. Munoz's BAC was 0.12. Gina Lazara, 13 Action News. Still